I started cooking tri-tip at 10 years old, and here are the best tips I can give you. Growing up in California, tri-tip is a way of life, so here's what I've learned. Tip number one, don't trim off too much fat. Yes, fat is flavor, but it's also gonna protect your meat during a long cook. After rubbing down my meat with some West Coast Sweet Heat by Rub City, we get to tip number two, and that is smoke your tri-tip at a low temperature before searing. I don't care what you smoke it on, but trust me, your tri-tip is begging for smoke. And now tip number three, sear on a flat surface. Yes, sear marks are pretty, but trust me, nothing locks in juice and flavor like searing on a flat surface. I'm gonna make sure I sear every side of this beautiful tri-tip that I'm gonna pull at 125 in turn temp. I'm going to let my meat rest for about 10 minutes and during those 10 minutes the temperature will climb another 10 degrees. And finally tip number four, top that tri-tip with some fresh chimichurri sauce for an absolute flavor explosion.